Hi guys, it's Kaf here from Kafaya Obani But Online. In this short IFTTT tutorial, I'll show you my five must-have IFTTT applets for online marketers. IFTTT is super cool because it automates the process of distributing content across various social media and web 2.0 platforms. Now, why do you want to do this? I'm giving you two key reasons. The first one is that your customers can, can be found across the various social media platforms and they're not just on one platform. So when you're getting content out there, you need to make sure you're, you're reaching each customer on the various platforms. Um, and this is what IFTTT is really helpful with, is it can automate the process of getting this content out there without you sort of having to manually go to every platform to upload it. And so instead of actually focusing on, um, uh, you know, distributing the content, you can solely focus on creating super cool, high quality content. The second reason is for SEO optimization reasons, so SEO. So if you're like me and you do a lot of blogging, then when you distribute your blog across the various social media platforms, what it does is it creates what we call these backlinks, and these backlinks help with the ranking of your blog article. It's also really, really cool for YouTube, so if you get your YouTube video out, across the various social media platforms, then this can actually help with ranking your YouTube video. So it's a must to actually be just distributing your content. Um, if you stick around to the very end, I show you how you can set up a really cool sort of complex um, IFTTT um, syndication, um, which will help with the, you know, sort of awesome, almost sort of streamline this kind of automatic distribution across the various social media platforms. For those of you who don't know, IFTTT stands for if this, then that. Let's go over here. There's some, I'm like on IFTTT.com. And what it allows you to do, it allows you to combine two services using a trigger and an action. So when using, when so, so when something changes in one service, it will trigger an action in another. And so what I've actually done for you before and in the past, if you want to kind of have more idea about how IFTTT works in more detail, I have done. Um, an actual blog article for how to use IFTTT for beginners and it comes along with a super cool video. Don't worry, I'll link this in the, in the description of this video for those of you who want to find out a bit more. Um, so kind of let's kick off with these five cool applets and in order to sort of explain like which of you know, the five applets I'm, I want to sort of use for an online marketer, I think it's kind of useful to explain my kind of marketing strategy. So like I said to you before, guys, I do a lot of blogging and I like to do either in blog form or video form on YouTube. So with that in mind, if we look at an example of a blog, then you'll see what I do is I tend to have, I've got my blog heading here and then I've got a picture. You can just picture here, this picture is going to be used for my Pinterest and my Instagram. And so when I distribute this blog post, this is going to be the picture that is connected with the blog post. And then if you scroll down to the blog, you can see I've got a YouTube video which is embedded in pretty much all my blog posts. And so basically, when I'm distributing my WordPress blog all over the place, people are also going to see this YouTube video. So I'm helping to rank the blog post and also helping to rank my YouTube video, which is super duper cool. To distribute this, uh, my blog post, I like to use places like I would tweet it, and I would send it out via Facebook. Um, there's other social media, or sort of web 2.0 platforms, blogger platforms like um, Blogger and Tumblr. And instead of you know using a Blogger and Tumblr to send out, um, to sort of distribute this, uh, my WordPress blog article, instead I prefer to use like YouTube videos on Tumblr and uh, Blogger because I found I get better engagement when these um, blog um, platforms have a video. So that's kind of decided my choice when it comes to the five applets. So let's look at the five applets here. Let's find it. There we go. Back to the article here. Um, I'm actually going to just take you to IFTTT. So I've already logged in and I've created an account. I actually have a pro account. If you have a free account, then you actually get free applets um, that you can use for free. But if you sort of like me, if you decide to go and upgrade to pro, Get sort of unlimited, which I, I definitely think for I think like three dollars ninety nine, um, three pounds ninety nine, it's sort of really cheap and sort of way worth the effort given all the time you'll save. So let's look at the applets. Uh, so the first one is, ooh, um, let's look at it on the blog article actually. So tweet your um, I tweet my WordPress post, 
And like I said, this creates a super cool backlink. So when anyone goes on Twitter and they see my tweet, which is this WordPress post, it creates this sort of really cool backlink. Um, and if you find it on the IFTTT one, post yeah, you can see like it's super popular, like 27 and a half, uh, 27.5 thousand people. Um, K people are actually using this um, app here because it's super, super useful, super helpful. Um, and that's how you can tell it's actually a really good app to have. If we move on to, where is it? The next one. So I published my WordPress blog uh, to fake my Facebook page. Again, 34.5k people are already using this app. There. Again, showing how popular it is. So I've got my blog post. I showed you how I created it. Then I tweet it out. Then I get it out on Facebook. Once I have it on Facebook, then I have another applet, which takes this post from Facebook to Instagram. Um, again, 8.6k people are already using this applet because it's super awesome. Um, my fourth applet is um, to get on my YouTube videos onto Blogger and to um, Tumblr. Like I said before, I instead of you know using Blogger, I've been mean, using Tumblr or Blogger to post my WordPress um, WordPress blog. I tend to just put videos in there instead because they get better engagement. And with each of my YouTube videos in the description, it has a link to my blog, so it sort of has a full circle of connection. So those are my five sort of must-have. And as you can see, each of the five that I have picked have got a couple of thousand people already using them because they're super useful and it's super duper helpful. Um, I ideally would have loved to have a Pinterest, and I did have a Pinterest applet. Uh, which would pin my WordPress post to a Pinterest board. But um, IFTTT are currently making changes to align um, IFTTT to Pinterest. So currently, you do not have that option. But when it's up and running, I most definitely will kick it and use it as one of my top marketing, I mean, top applets for an online marketer. Um, if you... So, um, automation. So you can actually go in, it's pretty easy. If you go to IFTTT, I've already logged in and you can see I've created an account. And if you want to actually create one of these applets I've just described, you literally go to explore. Um, and you can actually just search. So just say we have a tweet or Twitter. You can find, like I've got here, here's one of the applets I had installed before. And here's the one I've got actually, called, um, I've been connected with. So you literally just go into explore and type in, um, part of the name of the platform or what you want to do in my case between the tweet you find the platform I mean you find the applet and then you just connect your respective account like I said I have created a beginner's guide to using IFTTT which goes into detail about how to do this which is super quick and easy to do now if you don't want to kind of do this whole process of actually finding the applets and installing them and you would like like me to have this as well as really intricate um, IFTTT syndication, social media marketing syndications, then you can go to places like, ooh, where am I? Uh, yeah, here we go. You can go to places like Fiverr.com. So if we head over to Fiverr.com, let's actually just open up the page now. Fiverr.com. Um, this is where you can find freelancers, and these freelancers can create these super awesome, like I said, these super awesome um, IFTT sort of automation or syndications to streamline your, completely streamline your um, social media marketing. Uh, so let's just type in IFTTT, see what it comes up with. Um, IFTTT for creators, and it's like super cheap. It's not like it's like, I do automate your source, but you can get something here for about four, four pounds, which is super cheap given how much time and effort you're gonna save and actually putting it together. Cool, I hope this was helpful. If you do have any questions, then do give me a shout. Leave a comment in the description. And uh, do like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you in my next video. Take care. Bye.